going to learn about the distributive property of multiplication over addition. Let's simplify what this means. The sum of two numbers multiplied by a factor is equal to the sum of each of the numbers multiplied to the factor. Let's look at an example. 3 multiplied by 2 plus 4 is equal to 3 multiplied by 2 plus 3 multiplied by 4. Let's see if we are correct. 2 plus 4, 6 multiplied by 3, 18. 3 multiplied by 2, 6 plus 3 multiplied by 4, 12. That's 18. This is an example of the distributive property of multiplication over addition. Let's look at an example with a variable inside. So, 3 multiplied by a, which is the variable, minus 2 is equal to 12. Now, 3 multiplied by A minus 3 multiply by 2 equals 12. So that means 3a, which is 3 multiplied by a, minus 6, which is 3 multiplied by 2, equals 12. Now, we need to figure out what 3a equals. So, 3a equals 12 plus 6. So 3a equals 18, which is 12 plus 6. So a equals 18 divided by 3. That means A equals 6. Now let's see if we are correct. 3 multiplied by 6 minus 2 equals what? 6 minus 2 is 4, multiplied by 3 is 12, and this is 12, and it's supposed to be 12. So, this is another example of the distributive property of multiplication over addition. Today we learned about the distributive property of multiplication over addition.